You know, you worry most about the people that you love and about making sure that they're going to be okay. So, I'm already going to cry. <laughs> so for me, that was the hardest part. Have you decided to have a surgery? Yes. You have? Yes. Oh, God, yeah. <laughs> and what type of surgery are you going to have? Have you decided that yet? Um, I haven't. It's between two of them, and at the end of the day, it'll be up to my doctor, and it could, you know, change the last minute. And ultimately, that's, I, I you know, I, whatever. They're just breasts, right? <laughs> um, I mean, I love them. <laughs> I'm, mine. Mine. But, you know, and everybody's really, they're beautiful, and, but, you know, in the grand scheme of things, they're just not, I would rather be alive, and I would rather grow old with my yeah. husband. How has it affected your career? Um, it's affected it. I think that people, um, people think that I'm sick and therefore I'm unable to, you know, perform and what will I be like on a set and will I remember my lines and will I, you know, be able to make it every single day? And the answer is yes, you know, <laughs> like of course. There will be once I get surgery, which is right around the corner, there'll be that recovery time and, and that I just have to take for myself. But, um, you know, and it's also, because you do, you do change a little bit while you're on the medicine and everything else. And you do get, you know, you, you gain weight and there's nothing that you can do about it. And you do get puffy. And I think, I think that that all affects a career like mine that's not only based on talent, but it's so much based on sort of the superficial shell that, that is right here.